Dana and I are out on date night and we're gonna do some ice skating here at the Ark Encounter, even though we're not really skating. One of the most important things that we try to make sure happens every week, unless it just can't, is date night. Date nights for us is when we get away and the kids, babysitters come and they do the whole bedtime routine and good. clean the house and they do a really good job just taking care of the kids in our, in our house while we're gone so that we can talk about us family, life, work. We're constantly working here together. Like, let's just get out and do something fun. I like creating memories. A little while ago, I saw that the Ark Encounter was doing a Christmas time, and they have a skating rink that you can go to, and I was like, oh, Oh, that'd be so much fun. Dan's getting her skates on, and we're gonna go out there, even though we're not really skaters. It's so cold in the wintertime, so I was keeping my eye on the weather, trying to figure out, is there gonna be a Sunday sometime during this Christmas time that will be warm enough for us to go and enjoy an outdoor event? My awkward walk. <laughs> But you gotta ice skate in the winter time, and this is the last warm day I'm predicting. As we're all bundled up and like <laughs> freezing gloves, yeah. <laughs> Seeing Tim stumble on the way out there makes me a little nervous because he's usually more short footed than I am. I go the wall. It's not actually ice. It's like a cutting board wax type material. So it's not like for gliding really. All right, show us your tricks. Double axle, pirouette. Should I go? <laughs> sure. <laughs> See if you can glide at all. Go oh, sideways. There you go. <laughs> I'm trying, but I also don't really know how to skate. <laughs> I feel like this is a lot harder than regular ice skating. I've been ice skating before, and I feel like this is harder for some reason. Like it's like you kind of stick, and you can't really glide and get going. I feel like at the ice skating rink, like you can you can start getting the hang of it and get the rhythm of it, but we're not getting it yet. We'll see. Try this thing. The wheel. <laughs> it's like you have to put a lot of effort into it to get going. The lights are pretty, at least. Is that easier? Uh, you you look like you're working really hard. You want to try it? Sure. <laughs> I feel like if I try to go on one foot for longer, I can glide easier if I put all my weight on one blade. <laughs> I need taller whales. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think they're made for adults. Hey, you should sit on it and I'll push you. Have a seat. <laughs> All right, you ready? <laughs> this is going to be like when we're old. Oh, oh you fell down. I did. I busted my knee. That hurt. Oh, now this is what it's like when we're really old. Now you actually need the wheelchair. At least your butt's not getting wet. That's true. I can take my time getting out. <laughs> You're not getting wet or cold sitting there. All right, the injured one gets to ride. Hopefully Tim... Don't bust your knees, because your knees are already kind of bad. Okay, let's go, old lady. <laughs> oh, man. The wheels on this wheelchair need to be greased up. 
<laughs> right, here we go. This is a lot more fun to ride it. <laughs> you didn't get to go very far at all. <laughs> Woo! This is your workout. Mush, mush. That's how you get uncold. <laughs> also known as warm. <laughs> That's it. We tried it. We had a good time. We're not there for very long. It's kind of like got the experience. Now we're done. So instead, we're gonna like walk around like lights. I think. Yeah. We're getting our time together, and I think you have to be very specific about that. I think that's been something that's really helped me get through this past year is making sure we're getting our time together because this has been a huge year of learning how to take care of Livia, getting her through three different surgeries, and I think making sure that we're making time for each other and building into our relationship has been key to keep us going this year. starting to sprinkle so we are gonna go somewhere else we'll find out we haven't figured it out Tim wants ice cream I'm kind of wanting something savory like uh, okay. yummy <laughs> <laughs> I'm thinking like a soup or a like baked something I don't know okay Wow, that is a lot of cheese on there. We've already had dinner, so we're just kind of here <laughs> like, for a snack. Like four. Before we left, actually, we ate at home. There were just kind of like little appetizers, and then we'll get dessert here. Just kind of something to munch on while we talk about work and family. Life, love, and family. Yeah. <laughs> Our conversations tonight were about a few different things. One, Christmas plans and ideas and what we're doing with certain elements with that whole thing is coming up. Uh, two, the education in school for Hallie and Hannah who are both in school currently, but will they continue to be in school? Should we take them out? And, and then your time with carting them to different places and pros and cons of, of all that. We still haven't gotten back on our Monday, Wednesday, Friday, though it feels like it to you, but we're actually just vlogging way ahead. So we're trying to stay on some sort of pace, but we appreciate those of you guys who have been hanging out with us over the past few months as we've kind of just figuring out a lot of family rhythm stuff. Um, so we appreciate your patience and we look forward to seeing you guys in our next family vlog, whatever that is. Bye.